Hey cute people and lovers of natural hair products. Yes, as you can see from the title of this video, I resubscribe to Curl Kit. They had been sending um, emails, I guess, to people who had the subscription before. Come back, come back, come back. We'll give you your first kit for 50% off. So I said, sure, why not? And then, of course, they had in the um, email that it was going to be a Shea Moisture takeover. So that didn't hurt, right? So I decided to, you know, join in the excitement each month of getting a curl kit because I remember I used to be so excited when I subscribed to Curl Kit and Curl Box. So I said, okay, I'll go ahead and do it. And I'm glad that I did. So I want to share with you guys because um, some of these things look really exciting. Now, see me, I'm a true product junkie. I swear that I am. And I'm trying to curb myself from it. And that's one of the reasons why I unsubscribed to Curl Kid at the time because I had enough stuff. I didn't need any more. But um, I'm getting back to my old ways because I want everything. I want to try everything. But the kit came yesterday on a Saturday, which was I was really surprised because it seems like being down here in North Carolina, I got the kit faster than when I was in New York, which is like a hop, skip, and a jump from New Jersey. So I'm not sure how that works out. But the um, reason, like I mentioned, I subscribe is because Shea Moisture has come up with so many different um, product lines. And Shea Moisture, that name excited me. I wanted to try something. But funny thing is, when I was in Walmart yesterday, I saw these products. Now, my box came before I left, but I didn't open it, so I didn't know what was inside. But when I went to Walmart, I saw the products, came home, opened the box. And yes, I did try to wait so that I could open up the box with you guys, but that didn't work. And I was like, oh, okay, it's a product that's already out on the market, which is okay, because I wasn't going to buy it. But now that I have it, I'm definitely going to use it. And this is what it is. Can you see? Shea Moisture. Um, this is the Red Palm Oil and Cocoa Butter line. Yeah, here it is. And I'm sure you've probably seen some videos already, people using it, trying it. Because like I said, it's in the store. So um, here's the back of the product. This is what we got. And the box was... Oh my goodness, it was so full to the top. But we got a total of five items, I believe it is. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And of course, I'm going to show it to you. But first, I'm going to show you the Curl Life magazine, which I've always thought was so pretty. The model. And here on the back, they have it again Shea Moisture. And as you can see, now the funny thing is, I thought that Curl Kit had models who posed for these pictures. But you know, I saw this online randomly somewhere. So if I'm wrong, sorry. But um, it looks like they just take pictures of um, people they see online. That's okay, because I would do it too. We do it all the time, right? And so inside, you know, little magazine, right? And one thing I like is it tells you what's inside the box, how to use it, or you know, benefits or whatever. Then they have a little article here about the red palm oil. Because like I said before, they come up with some kind of oil or butter. Every time you turn around, it's like, how many different oils and butters are in the jungle? I don't know. <laughs> but this is something exciting, right? So there, like I said, there's a total of five products. I'm going to Go through them really quickly. Like I said, you probably already seen them, but watch my video anyway. And I like the packaging. I like this red color. It's really like a really pretty burnt reddish orangey color. It's really, really pretty. It'll be really nice if I could find um, a scarf in this color. <laughs> but this here is a detangling shampoo. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to show it to you. I was trying to smell it the other night, but I didn't open it enough to it really doesn't smell like anything it has a real real slight scent i can't even describe it so i'm not even going to try but here's the shampoo and here's the leave in or the rinse out conditioner mm -hmm. so these two products are something that i'm looking forward to because i do have curly coily shrinkage prone hair mm -hmm. and it's sulfate free and color safe 
and again this is the red palm oil and cocoa butter line and then with that they also gave us um a curl stretch pudding this is it here and i'm not gonna open it but at least you can kind of see what it looks like in the jar let me see if i can smell this because i really want to know how it smells but like i said they got it mm, it's very 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 light can you see it looks just like a butter it is very very light and then we also got the styling jelly yeah and you guys know what a jelly looks like so i'm gonna just open it and see what i can see okay here it is this is more I can't really tell because the oh it's it's kind of thin, so I'm not gonna lean it over because I lean it over, I'll be spilling it all myself. And then we have the reshape and shine butter little jar. So you can see compared to this one, it's really a small. They're not, they're not the same size. I don't know if you can tell. And this here, what is this? What do they recommend you use this? It's so small, the writing. Why they can't think of we older doll babies that can't really see, even with readers on, rubber dime size amount between palms and lightly pat into hair or scrunch to help, I think it says recharge. <laughs> Here it is. I don't know why I'm opening it because I'm sure. Oh, smells really nice. Now I'm gonna tell you if you like just a light light scent and you don't want anything to overwhelm you, this is definitely definitely the product for you because I just tried um, another shampoo that was sent to me. The line three pieces and that stuff is like overwhelming but it, it smells good i'm gonna talk about it later on because someone had asked me about it but this is the shaping butter so there were five products in the box and like i told you the box was breaking up well broke up it's, you know but as always it comes in this handy dandy paper it was a shea moisture takeover there you go and that's it now i don't know when i'm going to get a chance to try these products i'm going to try to see if i can get to them soon because i'm trying something else out that i really want to share with you guys and hopefully i'll get a chance to sit down and um talk about those products because i do like them and um yeah that's it pretty much but you know one thing I want to share with you guys before I go, and that's what's on my lips, because um, spring is here, right? I think, is it spring, or is it just feeling like spring weather? It's nice outside. So, you know, I wanted to do something a little different. I did do something different as far as blush. Um, I don't know if this is orange or a pink color. I can't really tell now. But I wanted to try something orange on my lips. I was watching something on television. And the person had on orange or something bright. And I said, I'm going to try that. But this is what I did. I have on a Nik Nik Nika K lip liner. And the color is orange. Got it down to the nub. But this is what it looks like. And I think it's so pretty. But I think I'm going to be honest to say... I think what I'm gonna do is get another orange liner because this one here is a little streaky. I'm not sure if it could be because I've had it for a good while, but um, I just wanna try something else. I, mean, I shouldn't say streaky. It does, it's, it's not really um, easy to apply. What's the word I wanna use? It's not really soft, buttery. It's not easy to apply, but anyway. I put that on and then I put this on top of it from NYX. 
and I love these NYX um, soft creams. I cannot wait until Ulta comes near me. I hope it comes really soon. I'm going to try to go the first day if I can. I'm going to take you guys with me because I'm going to be in Ulta all the time. But I have this one top and this color here is London. So I have those two colors on. And I'm going to tell you, um, I take B12 because my lips are always dry and chappy. So I hope that they're not right now. Okay. They don't look too bad. <laughs> but um, yeah, so this is going to be something I'm going to wear quite often because I really like this color. Let me know how you like it. But I just wanted to share with you what was on my lips. Now look. This video wasn't supposed to go to 10 minutes, so I am going to end this video, and I'm going to say thank you so much for watching my video. I want to say I will see you in the next, and share and spread love.